What is going on guys, Skits here back with another guide. Today we're going to be going over my favorite add-on, the most beneficial add-on at the moment for gold farming. It's called Server Hop, aka Cross Realm Assist 2.0. In this video I'm going to be going over both Cross Realm Assist and Server Hop, but for a majority of it we're going to work on Server Hop. We're going to show you uh, kind of what the add-on is, what it does, and how to tweak it in the best way possible to get the best results. Stay tuned guys. Now, both of these add-ons do the exact same thing, except Server Hop is more of the 2.0 version to cross realm assist. What it basically does is it's an easy tool for you to cross realm hop. So for instance, if something is killed on your current realm and you don't want to wait 30, 40, in some cases an hour plus to wait for the mob to respawn, you can just simply cross realm assist to another realm and then kill the mob if it's up on that realm. All right, enough talking about it. Let's actually see what it looks like when we hop realm. So for the video purpose sake, we have cross realm assist and server hop both installed and updated. We're gonna use cross realm assist first and then we're gonna spend the majority of the time with the current uh, cross realm add-on I use, which is server hop. So cross realm assist is up right here, as you can see. On our current realm now, Kelfazad, Argos the Destroyer is killed. Instead of waiting for him to respawn, these add-ons quickly take you over to another realm to see if he's up and you can get the kill. So right now, as you can see, it says scan more on cross realm assist. We're going to scan more, wait for it to find another random realm, and when we hit quick join, you can see it is taking us to lightning hoof, and indeed, Argosh the Destroyer is up. So that's basically what the add-ons do. I'm gonna show you now the pros and cons of both and how to tweak them to get the best results. All right, guys, first up, let's go over Cross Realm Assist. It is important to note, uh, to my knowledge, Cross Realm Assist was uh, one of the first, if not the first add-on to indeed Cross Realm Hop to kill other mobs. So it is right to give respect where respect is due. If most of you, I assume, are still using this add-on, this is great because I'm going to go through both Cross Realm Assist and Server Hop Live, so bear with me if I mess up a little bit. I apologize, but as you can see now on Kel'Thuzad, our home realm, you guys already saw how these add-ons work, but real quick, Quick Join is just going to take you from realm to realm. Uh, at any point in time, whatever is up and is auto-inviting people, this button right here, if you click quick join, it'll take you some to some other realm, excuse me, Emerald Dream for instance, and you'll see all these mobs are up. So you'll kill them, rinse and repeat, you'll leave the group. As you can see, it'll put us back on Kel'Thuzad, and then you'll quick join again to some other realm, Hydraxis we're on now, and again, all these mobs are up. It is important to note that not only can you kill these mobs, but if you have um, a route that you like to take whether it's mining for ore or farming for herbs or anything like that not only can you kill mobs but you can cross realm hop to um, to check out other realms that aren't as populated and don't have as many people farming the spots that you want to farm so right beside quick join on cross realm assist you'll also see manual join we're going to go over that in a second and then you'll just see the exit out button, a refresh button, and then your settings. So let's just go over the settings real quick. As you can see, as you hop realm to realm, you're gonna rack up a bunch of different, um, I guess just a history list of where you've been. So clear realm history will basically just take all the spots that you've joined, clear it out, and it will tell the add-on that um, you can rejoin those whenever you want because it acts like you were never there in the first place, if that kind of makes sense. So um, this will clear your join history. This will clear the realm history. Also in your settings, you have uh, your mini map button that will show all language groups. You have a language barrier you can set up if you're actually looking for something specific and you don't speak a certain language. I know it sounds weird. You can set that up. And then also show quick join hints. I don't really mess with that. And then the quick join categories. This is very, very important for both add-ons and I'm going to tell you why. So right here as you can see my personal preference is custom and questing. I have those two checked on both cross realm assist and server hop and this is why so if you go to manual join 
this is going to bring up what we just looked at in our settings. So you have custom, you have Ashran, questing, raids, and battlegrounds. Why I only do custom and questing is because as you can see here, I'm going to explain to you what all this is. So the title of the group is listed right here. It shows you how many players are actually in the party and then it tells you what realm. So the green check means they're auto inviting. No matter if you have terrible gear, if you're looking for something specific and you really don't want to contribute to the group at all, you're just here for um, what you're here to farm. You want to look for the green check marks because these, if you click on join them, they're going to auto invite you. You're going to be good to go. The red X next to this means that you joined this realm. And then if you look to your left over here, it'll tell you how many minutes ago you joined it. So that's basically what that means. Um, so if you go over to Ashran, you're going to see there's not a lot of groups up that are um, auto inviting, actually none. And then what this um, question mark here means this yellow question mark means there is a note in the group to let you know that what they are expecting you to have so for instance this is a team speak comment so only people with team speak are allowed in this so again if you go over to questing you'll see golden everything is green good to go they're auto inviting and you can hop around again here is the yellow um, question mark it says the minimum eye level is 100 so I'm not really sure you know you guys will have better luck determining what realms are good for you whether you're horde or alliance and what's actually up but I stay away from raids and battlegrounds because raids are pretty specific as far as what they need uh, item level wise and they're not auto inviting they're checking your gear and all that kind of good stuff so um, also what else with cross realm assist this right here will refresh the current list if you click on that it'll refresh all of your realms and then uh, let's just run through um, the pros and cons I guess just live so quick join leave group quick join leave group what is going to happen after you use this add-on for maybe five ten minutes is the quick join is going to it's going to get bugged out a little bit it's going to find a certain number of realms that you've already been to and then it's pretty much just going to wait and wait and wait until the time expires until it's letting you rejoin that realm again so it's, it's pretty much protecting you from revisiting realms over and over again that you just killed um mobs on or farmed on so after you click quick join a bunch of times it will unfortunately bug out um i'm just clicking around just for the video purpose so you won't really see it now but i recommend if you're using cross realm assist to definitely use manual join with your custom groups and your questing those are your best bets and that should help you out guys all right guys so here we are the add-on of the hour what i currently use to cross realms the add-on is called server hop it is absolutely amazing once you uh, look up in your top right you'll see the icon here right under your mini map it'll say server hop you'll click on that and it'll bring up the same kind of you know um, drop down box that or not drop down box but the box that you saw in cross realm assist so I'm gonna uh, film this live just like I did with cross realm assist so bear with me here um, first and foremost this general box right here this is gonna just tell you all the current information so again you're on Kelfazad this drop down box will let you choose from either a PvP realm PvE or all and then this option over here will um, take you either it'll search for parties with four or less or raids uh, six to forty so that's good because certain loot only drops from either parties or raids so make sure you guys are aware of that if you're looking for a certain loot make sure you're in the right party size to obtain that loot so right here we have last and next next is equivalent to the quick join button if you just click that as you can see it just took us over to Bellgun and if you're like oh man I just hot realm and the add-on or excuse me the mob I was looking for on the current realm just popped up what do I do so since we just left Kel'Thuzad if we leave the party it'll take us back to Kel'Thuzad but if we were for instance if we went to Ursin and we were like, oh man, the, the, the mob just spawned on Belgon. What do we do? All you have to do is hit last. It'll take you from Ursin 
drop you out of the party, take you back to Kel'Thuzad, and then it will rejoin Belgon. It is absolutely, absolutely amazing. So that is that feature. Let's leave the party and go back to Kel'Thuzad here. Under options, I'm gonna show you what I usually mess with. Under graphics, don't even mess with that. Leave that the way it is. Search mode, you can mess with this a little bit. I usually don't because I'm always the one joining parties. If you're setting it up yourself to make a group, you can kind of tweak that and mess with that. And then hop mode. So this is the most important thing on server hop. Hop mode is great because you can change the intervals on when you want to um, transfer to the realm again. So for instance, if you're farming a specific pet, uh, for instance, the Ruby Droplet, I was after I was farming it over and over and over again and when you cross realms if it's not up why would you not want to visit it maybe three or four minutes later just to see if it's up right so when you change this I usually put it at three minutes or four minutes depending it will hop realm to realm the cooldown will be four minutes and then after that it'll take everything off the queue so you can rejoin those realms when you get to a realm that you find the mob that you want to find and kill kill it and then all you have to do is make a little bit of a side note whether you write it down just not to rejoin that realm until whenever the mob respawns if that makes sense so that is awesome right there to change the time you can um, clear all the realms that you visited right here so for instance if you go to let's go to change mode change mode is the same thing with all of the tabs on the bottom of cross realm assist you have your questing groups arenas dungeons and so forth and like i said i only really do questing and custom because they auto invite the most after you visit a bunch of realms if you go back into your settings you'll have visited maybe 15 20 30 realms and you want to go back there quicker just clear all it'll reset the add-on and boom you're in there again so with that being said let's check out um, this search box also an awesome feature of um, server hop for instance if you're looking for Kaz right and you're like oh I, I, he's not up in my realm right now let's just search K-A-Z-Z -Z, enter you'll hear that little uh, notification and it'll show you immediately what is up and what is killing whatever you need to kill. The search box is awesome. You can type anything in here and it will uh, link you to, I guess, the most um, common or um, whatever is closest to your search. It'll take you and it'll show you the options for that. Another amazing feature you guys have to take advantage of in server hop is the favorites. Um, option. So if and you look at the bottom right hand corner here, there's a gold star. If you click on that, your favorites already have four stock favorites actually in here. Vengeance, Death Talon, Doom Roller, Terror Fist. These are all for the four rares in the Tenan jungle to farm for the medallion of the Legion. It's probably not the most sought after item in the game, but the most farmed, I guess, currently. It'll take you over there to, um, so for instance, if we just click on Death Talon, it'll search for you know death talon groups or doom roller perfect there we go gloom talon is up the rare if you click on that it'll shoot you right over to that realm it is awesome with that being said you can also make your own favorite so if you just click on add we'll title this just ruby droplet and the keywords is the most important thing so anything relating to your farm you're going to want to put in the keywords so um the more keywords you have obviously the greater i guess chance you have to you know snipe a group with anything relating or pertaining to what you're after so for the keywords let's just put ruby uh, droplet you're gonna put want to put more stuff in there just like ruby lake or anything that has anything to do with the actual farm and then when you hit apply you'll see right down here your group is up so if you click on ruby droplet it'll search with anything your keywords ruby or, or whatever you else you put in the keywords box that is an awesome feature to server hop make sure you guys check that out and as usual if you guys have any questions uh, with cross realm assist or server hop don't hesitate to just comment below i will answer them as quickly and as efficiently as possible all in all cross realm assist paved the way it was an awesome add-on it still is it's a little buggy server hop is now here it is the updated version of what cross realm assist is and was make sure you guys definitely download one of these two 
and it's essential for all of your if you're gold farming if you uh, are serious about gold making you need one of these two add-ons I hope this video helped guys as always uh, like share most importantly subscribe I'm gonna be putting out a lot of content before Legion gets here and then when Legion uh, finally drops we're gonna be hitting it even harder so as always happy game you guys have a great day peace I almost forgot guys not only is this add-on awesome for gold making and gold farming but it is also essential to leveling and leveling really fast 93 to 100 my personalized video is right above me you guys check it out no potions no heirlooms no rested experience just pure leveling the fastest way possible check it out guys